What's up? It's Thursday. Thursday. I can be loud because Julie is at my mother-in-law's and um, that light kind of sucks right there, by the way. Um, but yeah, I thought I would like to shoot this vlog style because um, I've been sitting on a couch for too long and it's kind of like, I'm, I'm getting bored of it. Um, and I like editing videos, honestly. And I'm a little fucking bored. <laughs> I'm gonna be real, I have like a full team that coaches everyone and I just take, you know, sales calls and that's pretty much my day and make content. I'm about to go to the gym, hit, we got legs today, I'm gonna die. Slept well, which is something I've definitely been focusing on. And um, yeah, just focusing on getting like more sleep instead of waking up at like 4 a.m. all the time. Um, I can stay up a little later with my wife and um, get like sleep and not feel like I'm getting torn out of bed from my alarm. So it's been nice, it's been really good for my my gains and my recovery. I can feel a difference definitely on my lips for sure. So as you guys can see there, I just had a meeting. Um, he was totally cool with it, by the way. He was like, yeah, I'll post this video. Um, I'm not gonna show you who it is or who it was, but so <laughs> I had a client, <laughs> this guy, awesome, love him. I had a studio a while ago, I'm sure if you've been following my stuff, you'd know that, um, in Brentwood, and he lived in LA at the time, and he moved since to Florida. But he had, um, trained with us in person, contacted me five, four or five weeks ago and said, um, hey, you know, and I don't coach many people, I have like 10 people on my roster right now, and we have about 130 other clients circulating around the program. Uh, but he said, hey, I wanna coach with you and not any of the other coaches, how much did you charge for that? So we got a phone call, told him the pricing, and it was like, hey, for the 12 weeks, what you're gonna need, it's $2,000. And he's like, oh, I'm gonna pay you 10,000. I'm like, no, dude, you're not gonna pay me $10,000. Like, it's $2,000. You're not gonna give me $10,000. She's like, no, I'm gonna give you $10,000 and I want you to do everything in your power to make sure that I see results. And not only that, like actually stick to it. Um, and so I, I, he gave me his credit card number and uh, I did it. And so what I did for him is a couple of things. One is I set him up with an at-home chef, gave the chef the meal plan of what I needed her to cook for him, uh, made sure that any restaurant he was going to, I checked the menu ahead of time, told him exactly what to order, set him up with a trainer there, wrote his programs for him. Um, and the best thing I did was actually tell me to get blood work. And uh, we, we, the numbers weren't horrible, they, weren't, they were far from great, but it gave us a real good objective measurement and a look, and I recommend you guys so much to do this. It was probably the best thing that, that we did for them. And um, seeing the numbers objectively were really motivating to make a change and really to like get everything moving the way it should be moving forward. And you can see, you know, it was just like kind of like a, you know, picture of his health and, and how he was doing in terms of like his sleep, his diet, his nutrition, um, and how that affected. And it was really motivating for him to make that actual change. So we made that change and, uh, you know, we got in the blood work and that really just put things in the right track. Now, when you guys get blood work for me, what I would do is I, um, when I go to get my blood work, they're not going to give me the full panel and most doctors won't out there. So I have a full list. I'm going to post in the show notes below about what uh, specifically I would get um, in terms of the blood work so you can see and see exactly what, what it's measured for. For women, the biggest one is the thyroid. It's like the mis most misunderstood hormone out there. And if your mom listening to this, um, you know, it's it's the most misdiagnosed and undiagnosed hypo and hyper, um, and it will affect your metabolism, basically your, your rate of fat loss. Um, and then for men, testosterone, also for women, very important is testosterone, both free and total, because you have a lot of testosterone in your body, but total testosterone isn't gonna be that high. And if you're a woman, if you have too much, it's not a good thing. If you have too little, it's not a good thing. So you wanna be in an optimal range because it's gonna influence your rate of fat loss, your libido, um, and just your overall health and energy. So it's very important that 
those are in optimal ranges. Now, again, we don't care what those initial numbers are. We do care that when we get tested, I have my clients get tested every two, three months, that those numbers are improving. We can see health markers moving. So definitely, definitely, definitely couldn't recommend more highly to get blood work done. Um, great motivator, great way to keep you accountable and a great way to just take emotions out of it and just like, just so you can execute. You don't have to uh, say, I feel this way, or I think this app, or I think my health is here. You have objective measurements and numbers don't lie. Very, very important. Make sure you get your blood work in the morning. Super, super important. Get your blood work in the morning because if you get it later in the day, it's gonna be too much variability. Um, a lot of different factors are gonna lead into that. They're gonna change stats and it's not gonna give you the most clear picture. So first thing in the morning, get it done. Most doctors don't tell you to do that. So make sure you schedule it first thing in the morning. Anyways, uh, yeah, hope that helped. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, duck. Yo, and that is a wrap on the day of the park. Julie, about to hit some more CPK. Got pizza fitted into a uh, my macaroons. Um, yeah, it's a fun cold day. Kind of rough day to be honest. Found out um, Julie, <laughs> Julie got waitlisted for preschool, which sucks, but I think it'll all work out for the better and she'll get them somewhere and it'll, it'll all work out the way it's supposed to. But uh, yeah, it's shitty. But anyways, pizza, for the macros. Good day. Love you all. Have a great night.